good night good night people people yeah long time i'm not alive not true but things they for talk some of the year yeah me have to talk because um announcement makes since evening no no we not surprised but, but we start by tagging the prime minister so you can see and hear how the people don't really feel since only me and few people are going to talk because I appear soft soap left for Jamaica right now as far as we may see. I not hear the rest of them. I not hear the Christian them. I not hear the good, nice, clean citizens them. I not hear one of them who suffer. I not hear the hungry one of them who have no job. I not hear one of them who went time night come and they used to can't feed their family. They can't do that no more. I not hear nobody. A few people at uh, so they can brand me anything they want to brand me as long as they say what I want to say. I'm good with that. And what I can say on the radio, I can say right here. So. so, good night to the people. Them. Welcome. They are listening to some nice souls, but I don't know what you copyright this is. We have to turn it down and talk the things. Them. So, good night, everybody. I'm going to wait for some more people to come. Why Jamaican people so soft and quiet? I want something to drink in the water where I come out a lead pipe. You ask the water company. But the lead pipe, them with the right cross 14 parish. Right? Or the fluoride when I know, you know, you know, toothpaste. Something now mess with the brain. Oh, maybe I did all cross his food, them where I travel across the waters from China come here. Well, not eat. Make no dunce and dumb and stupid. Come on, know if we can sit down as a people. And allow what go on in our country to take place. So when few people like me come and talk now, it's like I'm a I'm a troublemaker. Oh, that one, she talked too much. Yeah, let them say that. I don't really care. I'm here to talk about what I see going on in my rights as a Jamaican with sense. Some quiet because they have to compromise through government business, politics, and the company them where them work for. But I wonder when Jamaican people are going to come together and understand. Say, if we not stand for each other, not what them do not make sense. We could have lived in a nice, clean, uptown house somewhere, and I come there from broke that. You understand? Your daughter go down and get a car, gun man she want. When them are going to make we actually come together and fix up the country, the minister them don't care. I did say I won't hesitate, but I just have to start chat. I'm a grief right now. The minister them don't care. They live the best life of Jamaica. And them say uptown in all 14 parishes. Yeah. Hey, see, I'm bag of things. Nobody no grudge them for them things. But what we are saying is there's no equity in the country. So what do you expect is going to happen? Huh? I'm going to put my phone by silence so no mm. one interrupt. No one call me at this time. <laughs> Let me tag the Prime Minister before I reach any further because this is some serious things I go on. You understand? So let me just tag him alone. Can I not bother tag him followers them, you know, because none of them not them, them, them not no use. The minister them don't have no use in a government. You see me? Some of them have them position for much umpteen years and they still can't achieve nothing. I don't know what this sense if you're not performing. You cannot keep your position, but that's not how they do it in Jamaica. When you're not performing, your friend them when a power keep your dear. So that's why the other party could have did rain so long. Me a tag him, me a say, why name and Joel is Prime Minister, you have disappointed. I'm not disappointed coming on the expectation of them politicians. I'm to say no. You have failed at your attempts. To curb COVID again. Again. No. Uno tag him to everybody who are come on. Please tag the Prime Minister. Me not look for any minister them because I don't like them don't know so we not talk the things and we not talk them. Them know. 
But you see the head of the stream and them we are go for right now. So who no one like it, bite it. I am neither Labour right nor PMP. I am a Jamaican. Tag the Prime Minister, please, people, because this is getting out of hand. How can a man say he might try to curb COVID for much months now? And at the same thing they may do, back and forth. Go from 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 7 o'clock. And still, COVID has spread like wow. So let me get to understand something, Mr. Prime Minister. You are whoever you have a watch your life. And the people that will tag you, tag them, tag him, tag him, tag him. Tag who no one tag. Please, may I ask you, because when I come for you, I come for your purpose. I no empty barrel, I want to know that. So, as I say, Uno, like when I talk, and if you're a labor right, if you're a diarted labor right, come off of my page. I want a diarted Jamaican. That's what I want. Because that's what I am. So, I don't interact with people with either diet PMP or diet JLP. I don't, I don't, like, I can't converse with people like that. I can't. Like, it's not intelligent enough for me, not sensible enough. So I argue with people who are dying to this or that. I talk to Jamaican people who want to see better for the country. So alright, I ask this question now. Why the Prime Minister keep on a bounce from time to time? Him go from 11pm as we say latest we get since this whole curfew idea. 10pm, 9pm, 8pm, now in Ghana 7pm. What the difference? What difference one hour ago make? How that ever help cut down the so-called COVID third wave? They say that the hospital capacity for COVID patients is overrun in all 14 parishes. Now, we, we don't see this come before it happened, just like a lot of people. We knew that about the time of Dream Weekend, that the Prime Minister would make some announcement. And that he would shut down back our events that was this was something that people were predicting already it's no surprise so he does it on the last day of dream which is going on now and you know it just goes to show the hypocrisy the double standard and the lack of empathy for the poor in jamaica and the middle class no no disrespect to dream weekend that's an event that i've supported for like so long i used to live in negril dream weekend was like nothing to me because i would be at every one of them walk from hotel to hotel venue to venue from it was ati till them split and become dream and then i do them thing for a while now as dream my god dream till be tired so this is not an anti-dream thing but we have to be realistic so back when i was advocating for the reopening of the entertainment industry along with the few voices that were heard um Dream was in the making, it was in the planning. The whole Mocha Fest scenario time, Dream was already in the planning because remember it was held last year and they planned for this year. Now the Prime Minister came under pressure from others and myself and Dream people and everybody who were trying to eat them food in an entertainment, right? And him open up at the place, I must say, July 1. Anyway, them go ahead and them give Dream permit from them time day for now cause dream a dream last night now what igloo I keep tonight right the last party five day party now I told them here find out said dream permit had it for 3500 patrons excuse me first of all I don't see no venue in Igloo where 3500 people can comfortably social distance right them are going to jam up Second of all, how come them get permit for 3,500 patrons when we hear say venue for big events supposed to be like a percentage of the capacity? I mean, they just blatantly bias. You tell people who keep run robbing and regular um, small to medium promoters that they can only keep events up to 100 people, including the staff. And yet, on a give dream capacity of 3500 for each event now there were two events on each day for the last four days and then today igloo is the last party i am saying to myself these people are very audacious they're very very bright 100 people 
for the regular man, including the regular man himself who will keep the event and his staff. So him only look for forget about 50 patrons. And yet, ODPEM and the government give dream capacity of 3,500. This is total hypocrisy, double standard and bullshit straight. Straight up. Prime Minister, you take the people for some laggerhead, some little like idiot where you can't just do things too. And then nobody not talk. And when people talk, you send police for them or even if you not send them. You're not an idiot. I know you're not send them. I know you're send them directly. But you're like an idiot police friend them. I arrest people for calling you all kind of dirty name. I don't go call you the dirty name them. But I'm going to show you your dirtiness. If you set a regular promoter, can keep an event with 100 people including staff and service providers and you give dream capacity for 3,500 patrons is a wicked prime minister and this is a wicked system no promoter can make money off of 50 people no promoter can make money off of 60 people 70 people that's why the people have thought said the JLP party is only for the rich and not for the poor and me a grow in a Jamaica and me too, me don't know politics, me don't know them thing there. Me don't know them thing there. People have them different things where they characterize the parties for. And apparently, allegedly, the Labour Party is for the rich. So that's why the Prime Minister now look power when we talk. And that's why I'm the same back broad. But I want you back for broad all through this wickedness one I do to poor people of Jamaica. Eh? When me hear on the news today say capacity for pay transfer dream at 3,500, me nearly cry. Me see any one month when they open the place to people a hundred, then give it. Eh? Then look down power with poor people. We are scrapsies. You know not see that? We are scrapsies in a Jamaica. We come like junk and dog. Animal as the government treat we like animal. Me son of a tag him because I don't care. Tag him. Wicked Prime Minister, you're wicked. You're going down to Manchester, going to give girl 150,000 for up in bar. And people there, Jamaica, were hungry, handicapped, homeless. Pitney were for send a school. And before you tell a young girl, say, if you go up in the bar himself, if you want up in bar, but you don't want to look good, you don't want to do no damage control for one to poor people. You're gonna Manchester pan video, Mr. Prime Minister. How much do you know? I want to come here for address you. You're gonna Manchester. You're up in bar, the woman. Trang, trang, young woman like myself. Who can go fend for himself? And how much people? 150,000. If you go do all one million dollar surgery right now, and you never find them down at KPH. You never find them up at University Hospital, Prime Minister. But you're gonna find woman. Down in Manchester, who did well want to meet you? If you open bar, what a disgrace. When me see it, me say, no, sir. This serious. And the Prime Minister, they put video, I act like a sitting good him I do. You never do nothing good, Prime Minister. That was not an act of kindness. What did you think it was? It was only damage control. That's all it was for all the blunders from before when me see the prime minister take hundred and fifty thousand dollars go buy a liquor get woman for up in bar me say no sir me have to go look one country migrate to come me can't manage this if woman want go up in bar woman go find her way she not old and she not walk with walking stick a young at girl with yellow lash and hair like a fini yeah i mean buy my own i'm sure she buy fear too how can you do that as the Prime Minister? And so much hungry people there, Jamaica. People where as the curve breeze blow, they all stop blow off. You never know if you go find them and split up 150,000 and give them 50,000 each. If you go to supermarket, it can last them for a month. Eh? Poor people know how to stretch their money. You know, don't like poor people, government is a wicked poor people in need in a corona time. And the Prime Minister got Manchester. Go do damage control video. I give woman, young woman, will look young me. Money for open bar. Mwa know how is that chivalry? How is that honorable? 
I, uh, maybe I'm me wrong. I don't know. Oh, me hear a man in a bar and the man look like him and them waters already. This is the kind of thing we promote in Jamaica. Immorality, low life and them something that we promote. We don't uplift people and all that we want. Look what the Prime Minister choose for go do. Okay, so you should do video and appeal to you. Look how much people do video and appeal. Where the young man where they do the video. Last week one young man do one video and saying how much skills and he want a job. Me not see him pan a video with the Prime Minister. When I hear me clear, I want to tag him. I never see the young man pan a video. I see a young girl walk up in a bar. So hundred and I want to ask you something. She have him already. Cause hundred and fifty thousand cannot build the bar plus stack it. And the next thing I want to reach to know, Mr. Prime Minister, when she stack the bar now, this week, by the 11th, where your announcement make for who are going bar? You lock down every entertainment in Jamaica. Oh, no, 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 the girl can't tag her. Maybe ask her if this makes any damn sense. She should have tell the Prime Minister, say, she want a couple million to develop her community. A bar, you want to go up in, go up in your own bar, good in me, no care. The young man say, he have some special skill. I remember what he say. I like how them go find the boy when disrespect the Prime Minister what the year. He want the Prime Minister find him. He give him a job. And before the Prime Minister go find the young man and uplift the young man, he find a woman who walk up in a bar in a fazier and yailash. That means she not suffer. Nobody who was who was suffer can't afford them area. Them can't afford yailash. 150,000 cannot build a bar. So unless she have a bar already and it did lock down, that means you get tricked, Prime Minister. Because she did done have a bar already and she can't stack it. Maybe I don't know what I just said. I just said, I'd foot the for the one. I don't know him, but who cares at this point? I need people like him who understand what's happening in Jamaica. Right? How you ever take 150,000 go up and bar the young, strong woman where you go look work? And a young man beg you for your job and how much other people do video. And you don't reach to them. You think we're an idiot prime minister and go a little bit of fool there. In most of the people, let me reason why they not talk up. They are not allowed the opportunity to get an education and to get exposed so their minds can open. So they can think like me and think like you and think for themselves. So the majority of them quiet, kind of poor little thing them. They not really get to excel. Them brain not really get to open to a point where they can understand what I say now. Maybe as some of them are here, me no one say, oh, she has talk about the Prime Minister. Me no want to hear not what she has said. Who is the Prime Minister more than the next man? Who is the Prime Minister more than just the next man who gets a job and uh, do it good? When him do it good, me we talk, say him do it good. I'm not here to hurt him personally. I don't have to hurt him personally. I don't have to talk when I see a woman. How it makes sense for the Prime Minister to take up 150,000 by how much create a liquor gear, a woman and a young man with skills and education ask him for a job and he don't respond to that the video there. Prime Minister, your priorities them off. Your priorities are not straight, Prime Minister. Your priorities are not straight. That woman's case should not have been prioritized. I don't give a damn who she is. Her case should not have been prioritized. Hungry people, they are Jamaica. Homeless people, they are crippled people, they are infirmary, they want sheet to put on bed, hospital one bed, wheelchair one. So, no take with the idiot you come on video with girl. I open bar, the girl, and I smile and I talk about. Oh, you know, you can't help everyone who do a video. But Ray, 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 you make a wrong choice, right? That's a prime minister. I never fear a video for pay mind to. The boy will have his skills, then for go, for go work. And him, you should have pay mind to. Give him 150000 for go start in business with his skills we have. Mm? So, another bad decision there by the prime minister. Yes. And again, we come to today, the last day of Dream Weekend, which none of us are surprised. None of us are surprised. 
that the Prime Minister is making announcements that there will be no more events as of today. We, we all knew that something like this would happen. So now that their big friends have kept their week of parties in Negro, they can shut back down events. Yes. So the people them only get not if the month good of keeping events with a hundred persons including their staff then you cut that right before dream weekend you cut it down you say eight o'clock in the night blah 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 all your little stupid time change them like that affect covid and then now that dream weekend is over you say no more events no more events because you very well know that after the summer, not many events come down the line for the rest of the year. This is so wicked, Prime Minister. You're wicked. Your decisions, them wicked. Me don't know what else to say. Futa de panino. Big up yourself, Futa. <laughs> Listen, the people, them saw out. Too much GMO food make them pitney them come up dumb. Understand what we are got through, people. Me all line out some things for now. When you eat low nutritional foods as a child, you grow up to be not so smart. That's a fact. It's scientific. One, you're drinking water that's coming out of lead pipes in some circumstances and includes chlorine and other chemicals which are for slowing your brain activity. And you're drinking this from a child, right? You're eating genetically modified foods which are sprayed with pesticides and chemicals. And so you have a whole set of people who have um, underlying issues due to all these things that they're consuming, right? You end up with a population with weak immune systems and so the COVID can spread amongst these people. Now, what is the COVID? The COVID is a virus just like all these other viruses under the SARS name. Don't get it twisted. It's not like it's something new, right? So how do we fight viruses? We should consume antivirals and eat high nutritional foods to ward off virus, right? This makes sense. But ask Christopher Tufton to tell you that and see if he's going to tell you. He's not going to tell you that he's going to take vaccine. So all who want to take a vaccine, go on. Nobody not stop you. But don't act like if you don't take a vaccine, the country can continue. You don't see it's a foolishness that's going in a place. And, and by the way, prepare yourselves for the mandatory vaccination orders which are coming. All right? Because this prime minister is right in line with the colonizers and the invaders who are the Americans, who are also Europeans who invaded America and took it over. So understand the picture, people. Right? They're never ever going to be in line with what I am saying so you have the majority of the population whose brains have been slowed down from an early stage so by the time they reach certain age they are not gonna be like the Africans who were here before the warriors and the slaves that they took from all over the Caribbean who were given so-called trouble on the plantations they dumped them off here in Jamaica you're not gonna find a lot of those people anymore here because the food coming up throughout their lifetime has dumbed them down. That's the first thing I want you to observe. So there's a difference between the rebellious set of Jamaicans and the ones who are here now. Futa say you're the female Futa. <laughs> Futa then just call me Muta a while ago, you know. So me say yes, me I miss Muta, but I can be Miss Futa too. Yeah. Cause we have to talk. So we have a whole generation of people who becoming dumber and dumber by what we are consuming. I want you people to take this seriously. So the Prime Minister knows that the people are not going to come together and rebel. He knows that people like Futa and myself and Muta and some other people are far and few between. The Prime Minister knows this. He is confident that only a small amount of us would die for this cause and die for humanity and die for our country. He knows that most of the people are only interested in frivolous things. And so that is why he feels so empowered to behave the way he's behaving. Futa. Let me bring it in. Is he there? 
put up, forgive me if I don't get your on right now. Try me again. Oh, see you there. I force me to bring people from live except my mother. And every time I bring my mother, she cut it off. Don't cut off my live. <laughs> I know, sir. Earlier, I'm a try to lie, man. I'm saying I'm black. Because um, the so-called shot of them will want to kill me. Go report the, the, the picture of them. <laughs> Why me I tell you this is ridiculous what's happening? But you are now. We just come on and tell you, sir. You are the Papa. first female. No, I don't eat meat. You are the first female when we hear a peak like this. And we just wonder why you never been at a long time. You know, sir, more than social media and radio. You try to be are you open here? You hear me the pan Irie, 14 years now. I mean, see what I'm doing. I'm the last one. I have a year now. I'm the new. Me the pan Irie feel like 14 years. You know, me need a record, Irie. Me think more people need to hear me, you know. At the only way we are going to see them, the black people, them, are Jamaican. Because them not... Um, equipping of to save themselves, you know. You understand? Yeah. And don't... Put it in the and put it and tell them. Yeah, so everything when me hear I talk a total logic and that's why I'm enjoying the life so that some of my people can see your face because really different from social media. Thank like you. Instagram is different from YouTube because right. some of them are over YouTube them don't over us. I never yeah. have to them over here, so don't over YouTube. So, mm. you know, I stay long, but that's why you yeah. continue you know, spit knowledge because sometimes too, we are man and we are safe. Yeah. You know, some man of you go, oh, them boy, they chat too much. Just two years have the more intelligence than them, have the more knowledge. Them why you look yeah. like. I want to hear them boy, they are falling in the shame of chat. Man. But then we accept the truth from a female. So, yeah. sometimes we like when other people are speak up without speak to me. Right, like, right. Somebody just tag me in your program now. I'm going to see I say the exact same thing with me. I say, so somebody females and males and pam, my page now can say, oh, so I just put a get up at that when you feel the talk. So I want to talk to you for a second. You know, most of the time, why the man, the man, even the woman, we not um, understand what you say because really and truly, we see with them, nobody can teach them and they don't see them. So they don't even know the rules. Which we are facing. The need. No. All right, we'll just go and beat and teach. May I go and watch? Yeah, all right. Yeah. All right, hear me, people. We can't just sit down. So, all right, watch the people in my grenade and all. Them decide, say, whether or not government won't like it, them are go carnival today. No, me is not a carnival person. But I get where they're coming from. How can you have countries like Grenada, Jamaica, and other Caribbean countries where so much poor people there? And you lock down some of their industry where allow them to can't just eat food. Some people can't go to the supermarket in Jamaica and buy a set of groceries. What they do, they buy from day to day from the shop or even from the corner store or Mr. Chin or whatever. Whatever. Them just buy tonight dinner because I doubt them can afford so when you shut up that now, 7 o'clock, no, when somebody leave work, 5 o'clock, and it take them an hour and a half from halfway tree to reach where them live, right? In a traffic and all of that. And your lucky kind of shop from 6 or 6.30, the police come through and harass everybody and lock down. How them the people eat dinner that the evening day? They don't care about poor people in Jamaica. They don't care. And I tell the people, them own the people up in a Narbrook, Cherry Gardens, anyone who want there with an uptown cell, who no not safe, who no need to join with the poor people, they might make the government understand that, say, through no own sake, poor people are all right in Jamaica too. And if not, nothing will get better. Who no go get rub, who no go get stick up, extortion, who no go get worse, they might go pickpocket.